Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the blood supply of the teeth. The teeth receive blood supply from the branches of the maxillary artery and the maxillary artery is the largest branch of the external carotid artery and the maxillary artery is one of the two terminal branches of the external carotid artery. The upper jaw teeth get blood supply from the posterior superior alveolar artery and infraorbital artery. Both these arteries are branches of the third part of the maxillary artery. The lower jaw teeth get blood supply from the inferior alveolar artery and the inferior alveolar artery is the branch of the first part of the maxillary artery. So this is our maxillary artery. This is the posterior superior alveolar artery. This is the infraorbital artery. These are coming from the third part of the maxillary artery. This is the maxillary artery. And this is the inferior alveolar artery. That is the branch of the first part of the maxillary artery. Okay. So, the inferior alveolar artery is a branch of the first part of the maxillary artery. The inferior alveolar artery enters the mandibular canal via the mandibular foramen, continues through the mandibular canal, and supplies the mandibular teeth. This is the mandibular canal here. This artery is accompanied by the nerve and the vein and the branches from this artery goes to the root of the teeth. Also, we have some branches going to the periodontal tissue. Okay. The posterior superior artery supplies the molar and premolar teeth of the upper jaw. Okay. The infraorbital artery supplies the canine and incisor teeth of the upper jaw. These are the blood supply of the teeth. So both the upper jaw and lower jaw are getting blood supply from the branches of the maxillary artery. Upper jaw or the maxillary teeth are getting blood supply from the maxillary artery, third part of maxillary artery. And the lower jaw teeth or mandibular teeth are getting blood supply from the first part of the maxillary artery. Okay. So we got that the blood supply. I'll go to the nerve supply or innervation of the of the teeth. Okay. The upper jaw teeth are innervated by the superior alveolar nerve. We have posterior, middle, and anterior group of superior alveolar nerves, and they are derived from the maxillary nerve. This is the trigeminal ganglion, this is the maxillary nerve, this is the mandibular nerve. Mandibular nerve supplies the lower jaw teeth. The maxillary nerve supplies the upper jaw teeth. The lower jaw teeth are innervated by the inferior alveolar branch of the mandibular nerve. The nerve enters the mandibular foramen. Okay, then continue through the mandibular foramen, through the mandibular canal, and we have the mental foramen through which we'll get the we'll, at the mental foramen we'll get the artery mental artery we'll get the mental nerve plus we'll get the mental mental artery mental nerve and mental vein here okay this is this is the chin area okay we got that okay so in our highlight inferior bilar artery and nerve Inferior alveolar artery is a branch of the maxillary artery, first part. Inferior alveolar nerve is a branch of the mandibular nerve. Mandibular foramen for the passage of the inferior alveolar artery, inferior alveolar vein, and inferior alveolar nerve. Inferior alveolar vein will ultimately go to the pterygoid venous plexus and they will go to the maxillary vein. Mantle foramen is present on the anterior aspect of the lower part of the mandible. 
okay, at the chin area, and mental foramen are for the passage of the mental artery, mental vein, and the mental nerve. We got that blood supply, dark supply of the upper molar, premolar, and canine incisor teeth, upper molar, premolar teeth are covered by the blood supply by means of the posterior superior alveolar artery, nerve supply, posterior superior or middle superior and the anterior superior alveolar nerve. The canine incisor teeth are getting blood supply by means of the infraorbital artery, nerve supply by the infraorbital nerve. You have to remember that there is no mandibular artery, but we have the mandibular nerve. There is a mandibular nerve. Okay. So we got that, and that's all about the blood supply and nerve supply of the teeth for the upper jaw and lower jaw and this is my reference if you like my video please support my channel please share the information with your friends if you have any confusion any question please feel free to ask me please support my channel please subscribe me and have a nice day bye now